What's up guys, William and Veronica Real Estate Team. We're back at it. Obviously Veronica's not here. She's out on an appointment and uh, Cardboard Veronica's making an appearance from time to time. So we're gonna be hanging out with her today. So this week we're gonna be doing our market recap and giving you all the highlights of this week. If you are thinking about buying, selling, or refinancing, or have any questions on the market here in real estate, in Massachusetts, feel free to give us a call anytime, 781-420-5391. So feel free to give us a call. So anyhow, without further ado, let's dive right in. Week, the uh, uh, National Association of Realtors Chief Economist Lawrence Yoon said that um, in August, sales were higher than last year, even in the middle of this pandemic, which is amazing. And pending contracts, uh, and, and listing souls, they're, they're going to be even higher. They're anticipated to be even higher in the autumn season and also in the winter. One constraining factor to that, which is sales and prices, is uh, inventory. Inventory is still down 20% uh, from last year, and um, it's causing prices to go higher. So if you're again, if you're looking to get the value of your home, this is a great time to look into that. If you're thinking about refinancing, you probably have a lot of equity built up from those prices being pushed up. According to a survey done by Redfin, buyers or sellers that were thinking about making a move next year, only 22% said that the elections had a big impact on their decision whether they were going to do it next year or not. My question is, why? Anyhow, uh, more local news here in Revere. Showcase Cinema is under contract to none other than Amazon. Looks like they're gonna be building a new distribution center. It looks like it's uh, moving forward, but anyhow, who knows? Um, but we will, you will be missed at uh, Showcase Cinemas for sure. Interest rates, interest rates for the conventional 30-year fix is uh, hovering about 3.02, and uh, for FHA, conventional, or FHA fixed 30-year rates, they're about 2.9. Um, that depends on credit scores and things like that. Let us know if you have any questions on any of that information. And today we're going to be looking at Saugus, Massachusetts. We always look at one city every week. We talk about what's available for sale, what's new in the market, uh, how many are under contract, and um, what's back on the market. Yes, we're going to be looking at single families, uh, multifamilies, and condos. Okay. So total available homes for sale right now in all of Saugus is 36, okay? And total new listings on the market are 11, so that's actually good. Um, new listings coming on the market seems like it's climbing a little bit, although we're still down 20%. And this is gonna be eye-opening for you, I know it is, because it's always for us every week, that under contract um, is 73. So 73 under contract contingent properties are set to close and only 36 homes are available for sale. So more homes are selling than are coming on the market. So we need inventory. Let us know if you're looking for the value of your home or if you're thinking about selling. It's a great time. Total homes back on the market are only two. So uh, that's this week's market recap. Thanks for the support. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the bell if you like it. Um, we uh, love all the follow-up questions. Let us know how we could help. And again, always thank you for the support.